So here in this video, we are going to learn how to plot 3D graph in few minutes. So let's get started. So for that, first of all, we are going to write x axis and y axis. So we are going to create two vectors of x axis and y axis. So here we have two variables and now we are going to run this. So here you can see these are the two vectors x and y if you open it x is a horizontal matrix by 1 cross 191 and the same way y is also horizontal matrix by 1 cross 196. Now to plot 3D graph we require three axes and in order to get third axis we can simply write z. And this is our z. Now let's run all of this and we get z is also 1 cross 191 double matrix. This is the values of z, right? So here we get all the three axes, right? And now if we write a simple command to plot a surface 3D plot, that is surf and then xyz. And now when I run this thing, I'll get an error and the error is Z must be a matrix, not a scalar or a vector. And here it's a simple vector, right? So what is supposed to do here? So first we need to convert this X and Y into a rectangular coordinate form. And for that we must add one line here. And command for that is mesh grid. So what this command does, it converts this X and Y into a rectangular coordinate matrix form. Let's run this thing. So here you can see the capital X and Y that we are getting is now of same size 196 cross 191 and 196 cross 191. So now that has been converted into an appropriate form. So now the X and Y is of same size but the problem is with Z. That must be of the same size. But here you see Z is of different size, right? And when you are going to plot something with three different size of matrix it's not going to plot so for that z must be a matrix of the same size so what we'll do instead of the small x we'll convert it to capital x and now let's run so this is the plot that we are getting a simple sign 3d plot there are varieties of graph that you can generate with MATLAB. There are varieties of command that you can use to generate 3D graph. You can do so much customization in all those graphs and if you want to learn that thing then you must watch these two videos. So until we meet again in our next video till the time bye bye.